I wanted to take you inside the molecular lab here at North Shore University Health System, Evanston Hospital. There are only a handful of hospitals in the United States that have developed a diagnostic test for COVID-19. And here in Evanston, this is one of the hospitals that has done it. They can turn around a test in about four to six hours, which is extremely important. Uh, some patients in other parts of the country are waiting days to get results of their tests. The tests here in this lab went online last Thursday. Uh, they are now at a point where they can do a couple hundred tests a day, and they are hoping that shortly, maybe within a day or two, they'll be able to conduct a thousand tests a day. For right now, most of the tests they're conducting are for the immediate patients here in Evanston, but they are doing a handful of other tests for other hospitals in the area. Uh, this is extremely important because there are extremely long wait times in other parts of the country. Now, what they do here is um, they're not doing a test where there's a swab and then a culture, and then you have to wait several days or several weeks for an answer to whether you're positive or negative. What they can do here is they can examine DNA. So if there is no DNA of COVID-19 in the samples they take from very far up inside the nose, that means then that the patient tests negative for COVID-19. Uh, this is really impressive and really helpful to those of us living in the Chicago area that one of our hospitals has been able to develop its own test as nationally we are in a situation where there just are not enough tests going online fast enough for health professionals to get an adequate count of how many people uh, may have encountered COVID-19, how many people may be infected. And from a public health standpoint, we keep hearing about flattening the curve so that we don't have a spike in cases, but so that we can flatten the curve. The work that has been done here will hopefully uh, help the area do all that it can here in the metropolitan Chicago area to flatten the curve. Just imagine it, this is a, a, a suburban hospital in the Chicago area that has been able to come up with this sort of test. And uh, keep in mind, uh, they were able to do this uh, for uh, similar outbreaks uh, that occurred in the past, the swine flu, for example. And now they're doing it again with the coronavirus and COVID-19. I'm Vince Girasoli for CBS2 News.